Hello viewers, welcome back to our Jardim Math class. Today we want to find the perimeter of this shape. And please don't forget that the diagram is not 100% correct. So there are some assumptions that I'm going to make that is going to be in line with this general assumption that the diagram is not 100% correct. So the horizontal line here is 19. So that is the horizontal line below should also sum up to 19. That is if you have this horizontal line A, B, C, D, E. Everything should sum up to 19. That is, the first assumption is that from a horizontal line, which is the same thing as A plus B plus C plus D plus E, this should be 19. So generally, from a horizontal line, just like considering this kind of diagram, we have A, A, B, B. So A and A must be equal. So from a horizontal line, I have it to be 2 times 19. That is 19 appearing twice, which is 38 units. So now we need to focus on the vertical line. So now focusing on the vertical line, we have this to be length 8 units. So simultaneously, this is also going to be length 8 units. Also, we have this length to be 3 units and we have this total length to be 5 units. That is, if this to this place should also be the same, that is more or less like a parallel line. So considering the line, a straight line like that, so that is from here to this place, I should have my three units. So and if that is the case, so from here to this place, since I'm having five units here, and everything here too should be five units, and I've gotten three units here, so this should also be two units to sum up five units. And the remaining length here should be three units. So that is three plus two plus three should sum up to eight units. Now using that, three and two, that is from here to this place, is two units and if I should have that tracing it down here that is from this to this place is two units and if that is the case and I'm having everything here to be nine so that means this place from here down here should be seven units because correspondingly we have seven plus two seven plus two which is the same thing as nine units so we've gotten that and uh, with that we've gotten the first vertical line the second vertical line the third vertical line the fourth the fifth and also the sixth so summing up our vertical line so i'm going to have seven plus 3 plus 8 plus 3 plus 2 plus 3 which also sum up to 8 plus 5 and lastly plus 9 and this is the same thing as 40 units So to calculate the perimeter, don't forget that the perimeter is the same thing as the total length of the shape. So which is equivalently the same thing as saying the total horizontal unit plus the vertical unit sum up to be our perimeter which is 38 
plus 40 then my perimeter is going to be 78 units thank you very much for watching my video please don't forget to subscribe to this channel see you next video